Another day is dawn. It's looking pretty foggy out here, but that's okay because I think today we're going to head down underneath the house and finally get into that underground uh, bunker or whatever it is that's down there that lets out through the garage. Uh, I have 18 arrows on me. I don't really have food and water so much. Um, I did gather a few supplies. Oh, we got some, uh, got some meat and stuff we got recently. So I can chow down on that. Uh, I'm a little light on... Uh, on water, because I still haven't found a cooking pot in order to make my own fresh water just yet, but, uh, I don't know, maybe I have to go drink from a ditch or something. See what that's all about. I'm not exactly overly well equipped today. I was hoping I would have some bullets for the, uh, the pipe machine gun that I, I found. Um, uh, but no luck there. All I have in, is the, uh, um, the bow that I have, which isn't very good, and, like, uh, 18 arrows or something. This, uh, this main area here, I think, should be clear of them. Yeah, there was only one that was, like, in here before, but we got rid of him. It's weirdly bright in here. It's, like, it's a foggy day outside, and it seems to, like, affect the lighting in here, too, which is super weird. Nice, another Spear Hunter. Power attacks now penetrate and damage multiple enemies. Yeah, that'll be handy. Especially on Horde Knight. Well, if I can get them actually lined up. So, that's another thing I'm going to need to try and take care of. Uh, I haven't really got a decent defendable position for my uh, for my Horde Knight just yet. They could present problems. There's, uh, there's a way to go up. Check through this. Surprised I didn't search it earlier. This will just be another bathroom, probably. So we have the, well, the men's room on one side, ladies' room on the other. So, there we go. It's been a really long time since I played this POI, but I thought, uh, thought there were more zombies in here. Probably gonna regret saying that. Got a new jacket to let on my cold resist. Might as well wear that. Okay, there's bound to be some here, right? I don't see any. I don't hear him snoring either. Alright, sweet. Uh, okay, so this vending machine doesn't work, but I don't have a wrench I could break it down with, unfortunately. I guess we'll just ransack the kitchen and see what supplies we can get in here. Hopefully something drinkable. Yeah, I got a little bit of food, but nothing I can drink, unfortunately. I'm not having any luck that way. Okay, there is definitely going to be stuff spawning over there. Seem to recall this one. They don't show up until you actually take the leap across, so... I don't know how many zombies I'm going to have to deal with once I jump across there, so I think I'm going to put a couple frames down over here, just in case they do drop on that little walkway. I don't want them coming over here and getting me. Uh, if I could shoot them from a distance, I would prefer that, although I don't really have, like, a crazy ton of arrows or anything. I've got, uh, looks like 17, including the one I have in the bow. Alright, here goes nothing. <laughs> Hopefully this doesn't get me killed. Oh, there we go. What do we got? Got a big guy. Oh, see, I don't think I put the blocks there. He's going down bottom. Oh, come on. Oh, there's a cop. Well, they can't reach me, so they're just, like, wrecking stuff down there. Maybe I should be saving this ammo for the cop. I don't have enough arrows. Ah, you jerk. I'm standing in it now. It's like they can't reach me, they're just wrecking random things. Okay, I can jump across. They can't get me now. Oh, come on. I've only got five arrows left. If I can't kill the cop with this, I'm gonna have a real problem. I do not want to have to go down there and fight them with the spear. Oh! The last arrow missed. Oh, crap. Um... Well, eh, that's not great. All right. Come on, you guys. Jeez. 
big drop there. I went into the pool. Give me those back. Go, go, go! Oh, I really don't want this guy belching on me. Oh, I saw an arrow here. Give me that. Ow! God dang, he blew up! <laughs> Okay, that could have been better. Woo! All right, they're clear. Good grief! What a mess! I right, should be clear over here now, I guess. See, this looks like the main loop, but this goes up into the garage, I think, through that bunker. So I don't know what the deal is there. Ah, metal lockpicks. Rat. All right. Can't get that thing. Handgun parts and robotics parts. All right. Ah, oh, what a that sucks. All right, I got some uh, got some frames. <laughs> Didn't get any of the good stuff. I could try to break into the box, I guess. Ooh, 5,000. That's going to take a while. And all the luck today. Oh, there we go. Another uh, thing for the crafting station. All right. Well, I didn't exactly score really well there. I didn't even get anything I could drink out of all that stuff. Um, pop this so we can get out of here. I kind of wish I could keep that door, but I can't reclose it, I don't think. Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to ditch my stuff here and then see what I can find that uh, I can get from another point of interest. Key water. I drank all the murky water I had, I think. Some corn seeds. I need a toolkit to repair this helmet. I don't know if I have a toolkit. Or if I could even craft one yet. I might need a crafting bench for that. Uh, the repair kind of need forged iron and duct tape. Uh, I don't think I have any forged iron here. No forged iron. Crap, I have duct tape at least. I think I can actually build a forge though. Yeah, I can. I just need the materials. Cobblestone, wood log, leather, duct tape, short iron pipe. I don't think I have what I need to craft that just yet. Alright, well hopefully the helmet doesn't break because I kind of want it to used for a light. Uh, it's pouring rain outside, but we do have a quest to do for Joel still. It's just a little bit to the north of us here. Could go work on that clear. I only have four arrows on me, which I'm not thrilled about, but uh, hopefully we can find some more bird's nests along the way. Alright, well I found the coal mine we're gonna have to clear out. Back off, lady. Get your own sandwich. Man, I seriously need to be able to do more damage than this. It takes so many stabs at this spear to kill these things. It's really not ideal. Oh, sweet. Those are better than the boots I have. Small improvement. Environmental protection, anyway. Alright, this one's only a tier 1 clear, so it shouldn't be that bad, I don't think. Vaguely recall this place being relatively big, though. In terms of, like, all the stuff that's underground. You who zombies. Huh. No zombies in the starting area. I didn't find any feathers on the way over, so I don't have... I don't exactly have an overabundance of arrows. It'd be really nice if I could find, like, an ammo... Pro oh, shoot, there's one. Nice if we can find an ammo pile that has some 7.62 in it. Level 4. Sweet. Well, I'm going to want to build up my Spear Master, and in order to do that, I'm going to have to get up to uh, Perception Level 3, so I might as well throw a point in there. Well, two points anyway. Okay, I've got up to Level 3 now, so the next point I got, I can get Impaler. Might be a little better with my Spear. Things real. Oh yeah. So this is gonna be a good place to get coal, but um, 
Not having any arrows is going to be really crummy for this place. Probably should have made a shovel. Oh. Got sneak attack damage on him, but not enough of it. Missed my headshot. There he is. Come on, friend. Alright, now he's dead. I didn't get my arrow back, though. That sucks. I just go up this way? What has got up there? Alright, here we go. Ah, oh, again I missed my shot. What is going on? At least I got my arrow back on this one. I really need to make a shovel. I should be digging up this cobblestone. Oh, uh, that went through his head. Come on, that's cheating. Stone shovel I need plant fibers for. I didn't bring any plant fiber. Oh, yeah, give me an arrow back. Now oh, that other guy started moving or I'd get a shot at him. Oh, well. All right, another one done. Wait, was that it? I thought this PI was bigger. They haven't cleared the area yet. All right, finally got the kill shot. Okay, that was the last one. Sweet, area's clear. That wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. For some reason I thought there were more more zombies in here in a bigger area. An impact mod. Modification for all melee tools. So let's uh let's modify this thing if I can. We'll throw that in there. Got a little bit of 762, that's good. Uh we can wear this. Oh, look at that. Pipe baton in here. Do shotgun crafting. Nothing in there I really need. Actually, the antibiotics might come in handy. I think I'm gonna need to make a pipe pistol. I've got a whole bunch of 9mm, but I don't have anything to shoot it with. Oh, Maltov's nice. Now that's it for this place. Uh, they're trying to break in here already. I don't know if they're beating on this door or the outside of this shed. Yeah, they're outside the shed. Oh, they're at the back of it too, no less. Let's get out of here. All right, Joel. I didn't think to bring anything to sell you, but at least I can complete like quest and get a reward. Apocalypse isn't so bad. Ooh, ten water. Uh, Pistol Pete Volume Five. Pipe bombs are really handy. Crafting skill magazine bundle. I mean, I need the water. But I think I'm going to take the crafting skill magazine bundle. Bundle of three random... Uh, I feel like that's going to be better for me overall. Hopefully. In the meantime, do you want to buy some of this crap? Oh, 50 bucks for that. How about some steroids? Do you like... He likes steroids. Pleasure doing business. All right, a little bit of money. Not really not really much, though. Do you have any more jobs there? He's got more, of course. Uh, buried supplies. I'm going to have to build a shovel for that. Uh, we got the fetch. Oh, fetch. 110 meters... Really Southwest. Let's take let's take that one. I can't thank you enough. Oh, the fetch quest is actually practically across the road. Uh, I might actually have time to go complete that right now. Maybe. Uh, maybe I should be looking at trying to get ready for the uh, the horde night that's going to hit tonight. Uh, we have the bundle of uh, crafting magazines we got for the reward. That gets me big hitters, which unfortunately I'm not using so much. Uh, who's repair tool crafting skill? I'll take those. And then knife guy. So, nothing particularly useful there. Okay, so the fetch quest is right over here at Joe's USA. Eh, might as well give it a whirl. It's not that big of a, of a location, I don't think. Although I do see a dog cage there. That could present a bigger problem. Crap. <laughs> so much for the sneaky grab. That wasn't too bad. 
Well, that door's unlocked. I guess that's supposed to be the way you get into the, the location. Um, I'm a little worried that the dog's gonna come rushing out, though, as soon as I do. <laughs> No, I saw a dog carrier. Yeah, there's a dog house over there, not a dog carrier. Alright, I guess the zombies are at the door. There we go. What? I just found a handgun in the toilet. Yes, that is amazing. I'm gonna drop it down here for now. Oh, I do have a little bit of 762. Hold on a second. Let's get this loaded. Nice, I was going to make a pipe pistol, but now we don't need to. That's epic. Huh, yeah, I guess I'm supposed to go this way. And you're a random chance. Okay, it looks like I'm supposed to drop down inside there. Uh, I don't know if I want to do that yet. If I get in there, this could be messy. I'm low on food. How many on me? Times it's 1752. Yeah, we got time. I would wager there's a zombie in here. A little something to snack on, at least. I'm getting into something I can't get out of quickly enough. Okay, we're good. I can't get out of the storage container. Alright, I'm gonna bail on this for now. I'm worried about the time. Complete this quest next time. Oh, nice. Ammo. Good. More 762. That'll be handy. Oh no! I feel ah! Oh, I forgot I couldn't leave the area. Oh well. I'm definitely going to work on something different here as a place to defend. Maybe I could build something using this back building here, and then if I need to, I can escape into the house. Okay, so I'm going to do something like I what I done another time I played this. Um, I'm going to set it up so that they jump up these stairs and then have to jump onto a little little crossbar. Oh, I know all the wood. Oh, that's a problem. I'll have them jump on the little bar that heads toward the building there. I'll chop out the stairs so they can't just come up the stairs at me uh, on the side of the building. And then uh, if I need to escape, I can actually just like run and jump off the side into the, my little house area. All right, we'll go with um, like a center pole, I guess. Now, the problem's going to be that if the zombies fall, they may get irritated and just start attacking stuff instead of doing what I want. I mean, I don't have time to get this ready before Horde Night starts. And I don't have any cobblestone to upgrade this stuff, which is sort of problematic, too. Not sure how far I can carry this thing over. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work. This may not be up high enough. If I'm going to do this, I'm going to have to knock out these bottom stairs. Got stamina problems. I also need to unload my inventory. <laughs> I should probably not be doing this right now. Alright, too high is probably fine there. They won't be able to jump and climb up that. Maybe I should see if I got something I can do about my stamina here first. I think the only water I have is murky water, though, which is not really going to be terribly helpful. I've got murky water and beer. That's, <laughs> that's not going to cut it. Ah, oh, crap. I thought it was just to take the railing out, but it took out the floor, too. Um, this may not be the best idea. Oh, God. Uh, nope. Nope, that's bad. Scaffolding. Uh, how do I copy the... Whatever, we'll just stick it this way for now. Okay, apparently they don't think they can get to me through the thing I just set up. That's not good. 
I think they're smacking the building below. Trouble is, I can't even see them. Alright, this isn't working. Whew! Okay, we're good. It's good set up in here the way it was before. I have very few arrows, so I guess it's gonna be all bullets tonight. I thought I was gonna change this thing. Get wrecked. Oop. Reload, reload. Yeah, knock his head off. All right, still early. It's only day three. These things aren't too hard just yet. I do have a problem with drinking, so I need to get um, I need to get something I can use to collect water. I need that um, that filter thing we can get from the trader. Then clearly, uh, this thing I set up out here is not going to work. I need to tweak that thing around to try to make it a little bit more usable. And then, hopefully, I'll have something that's a little bit more fun to defend against the zombies. I can I can get at them as they're coming up instead of just um, trying to shoot them from the top of the stairs. Because as we get more zombies, they're going to start to pile up on that little staircase thing I made. And then we're going to have a big problem. Uh, I'm going to poke around for the rest of the night just grabbing some wood and stuff because I need the resources. And then... Uh, We'll pick it up again on the uh, day four. Do a little bit more looting. See if I can complete a quest for Joel and uh, get my hands on one of those water filters. <laughs>